If you're looking to build your God Squad, head over to CheapMaddenCoins.com for the cheapest prices, instant delivery, and 24-hour customer support. Hit the link in the description and use code WOLF for 15% off. Welcome to today's video. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys an awesome pass play that you can blend in in the Trey White Flex because the Trey White Flex is really good this year if you know how to use it right. I'm just going to add some more firepower to your arsenal before we get into today's awesome video, man. Make sure you drop a like, subscribe if you're new, turn notifications on. If you want to get your comment out, man, I'm here for 15 minutes after the video, after it goes live to answer questions. So hit me with the questions, man. You need love advice. Dr. Wolf has got you, man. Okay, I'm not going to let you fail. If you want to ask me something about the solar system, I mean, I might not be the guy, all right? Anyway... Become a member. Members, if you haven't seen it already, there's this glitch play that I put in the member section that I don't want no one knowing about. So don't even tell people out here. If you want to know what I'm talking about, become a member. The member, Some of the members, a few of them already have already seen it. They know what time it is. We don't play games over here. Giving you guys the good stuff. All right. Okay, we're going to talk about today's video. I'm going to show you guys something to add to your arsenal. Two plays that work one against cover three really well and then this other one you can use whenever you want all right just whenever you want all right so trey white flex name of the play is stick now this play looks looks dumb <laughs> right it looks dumb right put your receivers however you want them usually i put my fastest on the on the far end side for the crossing route i'll put like a good route runner on the outside so whenever i flip trey white flex it's usually my two best receivers going from inside to outside and that's just how we do the whole thing you know what i'm saying so this one's really good for cover three random cover three and the setup is simple okay you could do whatever you want with your running back however i always tend to block him for this one right here for the when i run this one i'm gonna block him and then what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna double team the left side guy you see this guy over here on the left side i'm gonna double team him now all i'm gonna do is i'm gonna take x and put him on a comeback route this is all i need this is a glitchy play it's gonna glitch cover three most of the time, if they're not running the cover three hard flats, Y or X is going to be open. Both of them are going to be open most of the time. If they run hard flats, obviously the flat goes down to the Y route. You're going to have your comeback route and you're probably going to have your B route. Now, this is where it gets a little tricky because you can use your running back to manipulate the zones on the left side if you want. But I don't recommend it, man. Just If, if you can't complete this pass, then just move on to something else. So as I snap the ball, I'm just going to look to the left. Double teaming their best pass rusher to the left. You'll see that he'll take off from Y. Or actually, you see that? Okay, that's what I'm talking about. I still have the comeback route. But you see what he did there. That was a hard flat, homies. That that was like the best call you could make on this on this offensive play. That was the best call you can make for the to stop this play. That that literally, you just guys just saw the best the best thing that they could have ran was hard flats. You'll see how he jumps to the hard. Okay. Now pay attention. He's in the hard flat. I already have ten open. You see ten? My man over here, but look what happens with the uh, with the stick play. He will abandon his assignment, and I could have had, I could have thrown it to the flat. You know, like I have two wide receivers that are going to be wide open over here every single time. Okay, and that's a cover three hard flat. Let's do it again. Block the running back. X on a comeback route. The play is already glitchy. Double team the left side guy because I'm going to be looking in that area. See, so right here again, boom. You can just wait. He'll leave it, and then you can hit him. You see what I'm saying? So it's like a hard flat. They ran a hard flat again. And this is just to add firepower to your schemes. So this is what I do. This is my thinking in game plays. I hit him with a couple of these. Another play I'm going to show you. A couple of small routes. And then I hit him with crossers. I don't just come out crossers, 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 right? No, I save that one for when I need it. So block the running back. X on a comeback route. Double team the left side guy. No matter who it is, just double team him, okay? Trust me. Right here, got Y route again. And you'll see that even in the purple, in the in the clouds, he's still gonna bite the B route, okay? He's still gonna bite it, you saw right there. He was biting the B route. So just put X on a comeback, simple as that, and then you wait, 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 wait. He'll leave his assignment. Well, actually right there, okay, so he didn't leave his assignment there. That was actually a good, I wanna say that was match. That was a match, but you're gonna have the comeback route every single time, no matter what. This is what I'm saying. This is a quick high-low read for cover three that works every single time. You're always gonna have someone open. Usually you're gonna glitch out the Y route. See, there it is. That's the glitch I'm talking about. He'll leave his assignment and then it's money. And this is why we double team the left side guy for that 
for that situation. All right, I'm gonna run a couple more times, man, so you guys can see that in random cover three, it's gonna it's gonna work. So right here, comeback route, stick route, boom. In a curl or a cloud, he'll he'll still bite that B route, and this guy's gonna be open. And you can also hit the comeback route. I want to say the comeback route is gonna be open most of the time. The cloud will leave his assignment, or the purple will leave his assignment. And when he does, like right there, he'll leave it, and then you got this guy. Okay. No matter what, he's gonna leave his assignment unless it's matched, and he's gonna match the flat, and then you just throw the comeback route. Does that make sense? You guys got me, huh? Last time, and then we'll move on to the next one. Now you can move your running back and then I don't know if it changes things, bro. This is what I'm saying. I don't use the running back. I always block him. But assuming that you could use the running back, well, it still works. You still got both routes on the left side wide open. Okay, so there it is, man. Practice it, lab it up. You'll see. You'll see what I mean as you lab it up yourself and see what's going on. You'll see what's going on with it. All right, so you see what's going on, what's going on, what's going on, going on, going on. Never mind. Man. I don't know why I said so many go-ons, bro. My bad. All right, next play is going to be the fake screen wheel. Uh, this one can be against anything cover two cover three cover four doesn't matter all you're gonna do is put x on a slant rb on an out route and then the route i'm always looking for is my man right here always gonna get me yards no matter what always okay always gonna get me yards say so run this setup again man defense cover two cover three doesn't matter he always gets open and i just take this to the outside now are you gonna get the most amount of yards no but you're gonna move the chains bro this is chain moving stuff right here and then you got inside zone obviously so you can just power it down and okay this is what i do i'll run inside zone i'll run like face screen wheel i'll run stick i'll run small routes and then once i got them baited i come to the pa crossers and then i set it up this way if you haven't seen it already i'm probably gonna get shedded off the line because i'm gonna keep play action to make it look like i'm handing the ball off and then i come over here and i give them the hadouken you know what i'm saying like we we just hit them with it so fake screen wheel, like that, boom, and you're looking for this guy. Now right there, you saw how the, it, that was a shade underneath. So whenever you see that, you could probably hit the slant, but typically the user's gonna, we put the slant there to bait the user. All right, so to bait the user, what did we just do? Slant, all route, boom. It, and sometimes he's gonna get hung up too, bro, so my apologies. And you're just gonna hit stick people and just go up the field, so. Little money plays, man, to blend in with the good ones for you guys. That way your, your offense becomes better than what it is. And then you can also motion if they're running man. I wouldn't be running this play against man defense, though, to be honest with you guys. But you can still motion slant this guy. You know what I'm saying? And then you got the, you got the slant over the middle or you got your running back. If they're all out blitzing you, one of the things that you guys don't use enough are swing routes from your running back. The wheel routes right here. This is another cool thing about this play right here. You see that wheel route? That wheel route can do numbers if, if it's ran against the right defense. So right here, just show you, give, give you, he's not gonna move. There we go, this is what I wanna see right here. So right here, I put A on an in route, okay? Put B on a screen, smoke screen. And then what you wanna do is if you have the time, which you're probably not, all right? Especially in practice mode, they won't let me double team the left side guy. If you have the time, you see RB, I pass led that inside. That should have been outside. Last time, homies, okay? Last time. You're gonna wheel route this guy. You're gonna motion over B. You're gonna put A on an in route. Smart routed in route, okay? Smart routed in route. And then you put the wide receiver on a screen. My bad, homies, I should have pass led that. Oh, you gotta take him off his smoke screen. And then you move him over, okay? Just follow my lead. Put him on a smoke screen. And yes, you will have time. Now, you see how they're not letting me double team the left side? But it's fine. I don't care. Boom. And then when he follows, you have this guy. Okay, so you see you see the two reads. The two reads going to be that. You're going to have either the wheel route or you're going to have the B route every single time. Uh, and it's got to be ran on the, on the strong side of the field, meaning where there's more of the field. Now, people have different terms and terminology or whatever, but that's, that's just the way I see it. So A on a smart route or in route, B on a smoke screen. And then you're just going to double team as far left as you can go. Boom. And then you wait, wait, wait. It'll drag them back. This guy's going to be open. And then when they play hard flats, then guess who else is open? Yes, your wheel route's going to be open. Matter of fact, before we get off the video, let me just run it against a hard flat so you can see the wheel route get open because I pass led that first one wrong because I'm a bum. I'm the worst. 
And it doesn't even have to be, actually, you know what? It might have to be fake screen wheel because we want to make sure that we separate. Let's go ahead and run a uh, cover three hard flats, okay? Where are we at here? Come on, man. Show me something. Show me, show me uh, hard flats. Okay, right there. Big down two, three, six wheel. Boom. Put them on a street, motion them over. Wheel route the RB route, smart route, in route the A route, okay? Smoke screen B. That's all we want to do. Double team the left side guy. Boom. It comes the hard flat outside possession catch that simple and easy bro okay the blue's not gonna play that close you know what i'm saying like he's not gonna play that close you'll be able to get that pass off make sure you drop a like on the video subscribe if you're new love you guys man peace